luxurious Roca Yisa development overlooks the southern coast of Ibiza. Hamburg interior designer Jan Vichers has a holiday home here, a mixture of traditional finca and modern architecture. The people who really know how to do a dream house are perhaps not surprisingly, the architects and designers. Well, Jan Vichers is an interior designer from Hamburg who chose the Spanish island of Ibiza for his holiday haven. And his place is a study in combining modern architecture with traditional elements and luxury. Hello. Hi there. Nice to see you. Come on in. Jan Vichers' house occupies a palatial 360 square meters. There are expansive views from every room and plenty of space for his collection of unusual furniture, like this chair by architect Frank Geary. As you see, the house has no entryway. You land right inside it. It was built with a holiday mood in mind, with the sea views, a different life, the life of freedom you have in a holiday home. The view from the sofa seems to go on forever. There's no need for a television here. This is my television, my panorama television, kilometers wide. And it's always changing. The weather changes, life out on the sea changes, and it's incredibly soothing. His favorite spot is the 160 square meter terrace. From the pool, there's a view over to the neighboring island of Formentera. Vickers loves to stand here with his binoculars looking out toward the horizon. An interior designer by profession, he has a passion for rare items of furniture. He bought these three tree root chairs back from the Philippines and turned this floor slab into a table. The back wall of this outdoor shower came from a palace in Rajasthan. Collectors are all a bit crazy. They can't leave things where they are. They just want to have things. I got that way through my work, because these things have a certain aesthetic appeal. They can add something to an interior. The living room leads directly to the bedroom. The concept of open living is in evidence here. There's no separate bathroom, and the wash basin is at the back of the bed. Christiana Wichers, the designer's wife, is responsible for the art in the house. For the walls, she predominantly chose photographs, including portraits of Spanish painter Pablo Picasso and Italian actress Sofia Loren. The living room is decorated with African tin art made from discarded objects found on the streets. These little sculptures have a form and they have a soul. They're made by hand, with great imagination. And that fascinates me. Daylight floods into the stairwell through a skylight. And in the basement, the designer has a little office where he sometimes sketches ideas for new projects. He's somewhat ambivalent about working when on holiday. I can't just spend two weeks sipping gin and tonics on the terrace or going to the beach every day. In that respect, I've always been motivated to work here. And I found clients here. I have projects here. I'm building something right now. But I wouldn't say I find it easy to work here. After all, he isn't here to work. He's here to get away from the hustle and bustle of everyday urban life. And he couldn't have picked a better place to do it. Oh.